I don't give the smallest or slitherest of fucks. This episode honestly showcased that this arc, the last episode and this episode is exactly what Dragon Ball Z fans have been wanting since, you know, even back in the day. It honestly feels like I'm getting a touch of nostalgia at the same time with some awesome new shit. It's like picking up where my childhood left off in a weird way because bringing back this character Future Trunks and his new problems and everything, it, it just feels like I'm getting to continue on what I felt as a child when I was watching Dragon Ball Z on Toonami all those years ago and seeing Trunks and everything and his problems and his tragedy and then this episode for all the people that were saying well why didn't Trunks go Super Saiyan what you know that, that could have helped or something look just look at the devastation of the fight that we had with future Trunks and Black or Black Goku whatever you want to call him in this episode Black was laughing Trunks went Super Saiyan and was trying to do some shit and Black was like, Pa, what are you doing? Like, come on, stop playing with me. He just fucking beat the shit out of him. Like, this episode was gold. This was gold. I'm not going to lie. Like, you even got a little bit of comedy that had me with my own personal little inside jokes, dying laughing, fucking Yajirobe and Corrin fucking doing limbo up in there. Like, this shit was priceless. This was amazing. Again, my raw reaction. This is phenomenal. If you're not on Dragon Ball Super, what the fuck are you doing? If you're a Dragon Ball fan, Dragon Ball Z fan, what are you doing not watching this shit, bro? Like, I'm watching it raw. This is my raw reaction. I don't even got the sub and it, it's phenomenal like seeing trunks like next episode we're definitely gonna get hopefully the context of how black came to be and everything and seemingly from the preview spoiler alert if you didn't see the preview you should check that fucking shit out spoiler alert yet again it seems as though black is gonna cross time and space to come to here because it looks like goku and black were about to go at it next episode so this ain't gonna drag its feet or anything like that but just between the fight sequence in the beginning trunks throwing the sword a desperate escape and black just laughing and based on everything that was said from black in this episode it seems as though you can almost confirm he's not a saiyan because he keeps on you little saiyan you're gonna be the last and all this other shit so black isn't a saiyan what is he that remains to be seen is he a creation is he something completely different did he just copy the form of goku was he a copy of goku's face but he's not actually him i mean even his aura is just black it's not even like you know saiyan white or a gold or like a super saiyan or anything it's just black so i'm kind of wondering if he's gonna have a super saiyan white transformation black and then his hair turns white that would be crazy as fuck but honestly this episode it was fucking phenomenal even the little kitty shit i love the interaction getting to see and i can't wait for next episode for little trunks i'm sure he's gonna have a ton of questions about trunks you know his adult form and shit like that but just seeing his reaction at first them thinking oh this is a unknown brother that he's had for this entire time and his name happens to be trunks and then him slowly realizing what's going on and goku and vegeta and then that ending i honestly was like why why did it have to fucking end bro that was too good trunks waking up and thinking he's still fighting black and shit like that and you can see the power difference i mean we know the power difference but you could clearly see how goku just grabs trunks like yo bro what do you think you're doing like stop like <laughs> This episode, absolutely amazing. I highly recommend, as soon as you can get your hands on it, watch it. Phenomenal. Loved it, and I can't wait for next week. If you've seen it, though, if you've seen the role, or as the, you know, the recording of this video, the subtitled version ain't out yet, but if you see the sub version, whatever the case may be, I want to know your thoughts. What did you think of the episode? What do you think about Black still? I guess we could cut out all the theories like, oh, that's Goten or, you know, any of those theories that, that got to be cut out because he basically was almost confirming he's not a Saiyan. He just keeps talking shit about Saiyans and shit like that. He's not a Saiyan and he also knows about Trunks. So this has been for a while coming that him and Trunks have been going at it. He knows his name. He knew a lot about him seemingly. So, yeah, your overall thoughts and expectations for next week's episode. Honestly, again phenomenal loved it and also what do you think about the little dynamics as well between trunks and my you get to see the little kid trunks and my and i think that's probably where toriyama got the idea from how they've been since battle of gods like pairing them up and shit like that and he was like oh so we'll pair them up together and it's like are we ever gonna see that adult my again because it seems as though it was really hyped and shit like that and if black is already coming to our universe this arc might not even be that long we might go to the universal tournament arc in a few episodes i hope that's not the case because honestly again this was fucking great this was really great i hope this lasts for another 20 episodes plus because it was phenomenal but who knows it's going really really quick and i'm like oh, i can't wait but again thanks for watching hope you enjoyed if you liked anything i had to say or enjoyed the video drop me a like i'd greatly appreciate it and if you want more 
info, make sure to subscribe, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and stalk my Facebook to get more when the video ends. I'm from Neverworld, and as always, people, have an awesome day. Seriously, this is what us as 90s babies, 2000s tsunami heads deserve, and we're getting it. Have an awesome day.